Are you still part of the RYC or Diaz tours? Um, actually, nah, bro. You know what I'm saying? Um, I was a part of the RYC tour, like, fucking, when the RYC tour first started and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, um, I suppose was, uh, um, I think, I think that's when I suppose and Fora first met. And they were, you know, they, they, they had just started out this formula. The first show, I think, was in, um, I think it was in Pacoima or Simi or Sun Valley or yeah Sun Valley and shit. It was at a tattoo shop and shit. Um, I was on the bill uh, for of course I suppose of course Reverie was supposed to be on there but she had got locked up. You know what I'm saying? And um, that shit went very well, dude. And after that I think that's when it took off and shit. And um, I suppose hit me and was like, Yo man, we about to start doing these shows. If you want to pick up on some, you know what I'm saying? So I mean he. Um, he shot me a cool little opportunity. I jumped on that shit, you know what I mean? And um, that was a cool little move right there, you know what I'm saying? I, uh, um, shout out to Fora, that nigga got his little fan base popping, you know what I'm saying? It was a cool little, uh, um, it was a cool little exposure. But yeah, like, like, like to be a certain, nah, I'm not really a part of that anymore and shit. I just been doing my own thing. My brother Icon is a part of the RDS tour. That's why um, a lot of people see me involved in that shit because wherever I go, Icon goes, you know what I'm saying? If he got the time, and wherever he goes, I go if I got the time, you know what I'm saying? So. When he's rocking shows, nine times out of ten, I'm going to be there and shit. And, and him and, uh, um, I suppose, you know what I'm saying, they've been working and shit and doing their thing and, and, and you know, just getting it in and shit. And um, so, you know what I mean, um, I suppose is, you know, putting him on the fucking bill now. And I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm just, you know what I mean, making my way through everywhere I go and shit, you know what I'm saying. So, yeah, it's cool. I mean, I'm, I'm kind of like unofficially officially on the tour and shit i don't even know if that makes sense but you know what i'm saying i'll be there man shout out to rds tour shout out to ryc tour um shout out to everybody on the uh, uh, everybody on the bill shout out to i suppose shout out to my brother icon you know what i'm saying what about your experiences in vegas in arizona man those are dope man shout out to out of state shout, just it's crazy man out of state love is tight dog like they really appreciate you know what i mean out here it's like oversaturated with so many MCs, you know what I'm saying? Like, there's so many out here, bro. Like, everybody is trying to get it in, you know what I mean? Like, and then when you go out there, there's actual fans that appreciate the music, you know what I mean? So it's a whole different type of, uh, it's a whole different type of love and shit, you know what I'm saying? It's really accepting and shit, like, you know what I'm saying? The people show love. It's genuine, you know what I mean? It's like real fan shit. They got respect, you know what I'm saying? They fucking listen to the music, you know what I'm saying? They're not just there, you know what I mean? Like. You know, I, I don't know, it's kind of it's, it's, it's kind of hard to explain because I guess because they're not on some Hollywood shit, you know? Out here in LA, you know, like I said, um, fans don't aren't, aren't even your fans, really. Like, they just, you know what I mean? Like, if you're trying to gain fans out here in LA, you, shh, good luck, bro, you know what I'm saying? Because everybody's a rapper now. And then all of their fans just go to see them and then they fucking leave, like I was telling you earlier, you know what I mean? So, I mean, you just gotta grind hard and shit, be out of state. Just get your name known and shit, but the out-of-state love is tight, man. Vegas is dope. Vegas is hard, but Vegas is tough, bro, because after the fucking shows, it's just like a non-stop party. You know what I'm saying? So it's kind of hard trying to stay hydrated out there, especially with the heat and all the alcohol. That's the fun part about that shit, you know what I'm saying? But other than that, I'm saying Vegas is dope. AZ is dope. I'm trying to make my way elsewhere and shit. I'm trying to go further out, you know what I mean? I'm trying to hit Midwest. I'm trying to hit the South. I'm trying to hit East Coast fucking overseas and shit um it'll all take its course and shit you know what i'm saying i'll be chopping it up with a lot of blogs overseas and shit um chopping it up with certain uh blogs on the east coast and shit um so you know what i mean i just try to stay busy and shit i don't got a manager so i do everything on my own bro you know what i mean so juggling my you know what i mean my my, my personal life with my with my kids and you know what i'm saying and and Trying to get money, which any which way I can, and then trying to do music and shit. It's 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 a fucking tough, uh, tough fucking. It's a it's a it's a juggle, bro. You know what I mean? But I mean, if you don't grind, you don't shine, bro. And and if you ain't serious, niggas ain't gonna take you serious. So you know what I'm saying you just gotta get it. You know what I mean? And I'm about to strike while the iron is hot. And right now it's hot for me because you know what I'm saying there's a lot of people um, in the game doing hip hop, but ain't nobody really doing what I'm doing, and that's bringing that street shit back. Well, you've been catching a pretty good hype from a lot of people. I've seen you post it on numerous blogs. We've done bio on you. But even the fans are responding to you. Cool. How does that make you feel? Um, Man, it's dope. It's love and shit. Like, sometimes it's hard for me to even soak it in and shit. Like, I don't even realize it. Like, I was just talking about... I, I was talking to my brother about this the other day. 
we were like at my pad and shit. He came to visit and we were sitting on the sofa and this fool's like flipping through Instagram and he's like, yo man, how do I, you know what I mean? Like, he's asking me questions and I'm like, really? I don't even know, like, I don't give a fuck. Like, I do my thing at home, you know what I'm saying? That to me, I mean, um, yeah, I'm in the game. Yeah, I'm a rapper. Yeah, um, you know what I'm saying? I got, I got a, I mean, I don't got a serious Twitter following, but if you peep my followers on Twitter, you're gonna see a lot of them blue checks, bro. Like, I mean, I got a lot of official MCs, niggas that I grew up listening to, niggas that respect me, bro, that are following me because they, they, they feel where I'm coming from. They like my music, you know what I'm saying? They, they see the authenticity, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, it's kind of crazy, man. It's kind of hard for me to soak it in, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes I go places and I'm with my children and people come up to me and I'm like, oh, shit, all right, cool. I mean, I appreciate it, you know what I mean? And um, um, I give the love right back, you know what I'm saying? Because that's what we're here for, you know what I mean? To, give love because love is given to us and shit so yeah it's cool and shit i like it it's it's, it's dope but sometimes it's kind of it's kind of like um you know what i'm saying like kind of like bam like on some oh shit i didn't even expect that shit but it's it for the most part it's pretty tight though you know what i mean it's cool man i just thought well most of the stuff you put out is known to be fire hopefully the product of your environment comes out the same which is set to release again when um i'm i'm, I'm hoping it's going to release probably like uh, late June, early July and shit, you know what I'm saying? Um, it's pretty much all done. I just, um, I'm sitting on two songs, basically, and those two songs are incomplete. Everything else is done. Um, but I be sitting on those songs, and then and then I get emails of, from, from other producers, like, yo, peep this beat. So then I hear those beats, and then I fucking get caught up on those beats, and then I want to put some, you know what I'm saying, then I want to like rearrange shit because those beats are hot and I think they should be on the track, I mean on the album, so I mean it's a, it's it's time consuming bro, it's a process and shit, but at the end of the day, yeah, most likely at the end of June, early July, I'm going to be dropping that shit, so just stay tuned, look out for that shit, you know what I'm saying, follow me on Twitter and all of that shit, and you know what I mean, you'll, 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 you'll see when it's popping and shit. Dude, we're definitely looking to looking forward to product in my environment. Thank you for blessing us with your time today, Slum. You already know, bro. You want to let the people know where they can find you at? Um, you can find me at a corner store near you. Nah, <laughs> I'm just fucking with you, man. Um, you can find me at the shows. You can find me on the, you know what I mean? Everywhere, bro. I'll be everywhere. But if you're really trying to like look for my music and 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 follow me and and and, and support my movement and and really just you know what I mean? Uh, um. You know what I mean? Just fuck with me, basically, and shit. Uh, find me on Instagram, uh, at, uh, I mean, uh, yeah, at Slum the Resident, Twitter, at Slum the Resident, Facebook, Slum the Resident. Everything is Slum the Resident. Like, if you go Facebook.com, Twitter.com, slash Slum the Resident, all one word, no underscores, no bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Slum the Resident. Just flat out, bro. You know what I mean? Follow me, look me up, salute me. You know what I'm saying? If you hate me, fuck you, whatever. You know what I mean? It is what it is. I'm here, though. Yeah, um, I just want to give a shout out right quick to fucking Stilo Magazine for holding me down on this interview, you know what I'm saying? Um, shout out to everybody that fucks me, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to um, all my fellow MCs, shout out to all of my, um, shout out to everybody I'm affiliated with, BMMG, um, the Antics crew, fucking the campaign and shit. Um, shout out to Pause One and shit, shout out to, you know, Self Provoke. Shout out to a lot of the rappers that I fuck with and shit, you know what I mean? Shout out to the Rhyme Addicts, XP. Ill word, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to uh, Rick's Rumble, OG, TNM, uh, my brother Owen, of course, again. Shout out to my brother Evolve, uh, um, fucking um, Juke the First, Neighborhood Kenny, all of them niggas, man. You know what I'm saying I got a lot of people that I fuck with, man. So I mean, if I didn't mention your name, you already know what it is, man. You see me, salute me, bro. I do the same, you know what I'm saying? You already know what it is. <laughs>